Hello everyone and thanks for hanging out with me. I have great news for all my North American ID4 drivers, driving friends. This is how I wanted to say. Um, finally, you've been waiting for a long time. You will receive an update. Volkswagen today sent out emails, hopefully to every ID4 owner, that an update is coming. Um, in Europe, we had, I mean, my car, I have my ID3 since September 2020. I received one, two, three, four, four or five updates. I can't remember in the beginning if I got two updates, <laughs> but. It's possible that, that I have five, five updates and, and except for one, all of them were at the dealership. One was over the air update 2.3. I'm right now at 2.4. But I, I got an email from, from a Patreon of mine. Thanks, you know who you are. <laughs> Thanks for sending me the email. Let's go into it. See. Hello, we're writing to update you on the current status of software updates for the first generation 2021 Volkswagen ID4s sold in the US. We've been actively working on software updates will be, will, which will be available at different times and through different measures. Some updates may be able to be installed remotely over the air, while others will require a visit to a Volkswagen dealership. Now, this is important. Again, North America hasn't had any updates since the car launched. I think the first cars arrived, I would say, in, in, in March or the fall of 21. I'm not, uh, uh, Mar uh, uh, in March or fall, in, in spring or summer. If you got a, a, a rather new car, it's possible that the... Uh, that the control unit for your BMS and for your battery and everything was already updated and then it's likely to you get an over the air update. If this wasn't uh, done, if you have a, an, an older car, then this uh, um, control unit has to be updated as well and has to be done at a dealership. Before the end of this year, we plan to begin inviting owners of model year 21 ID4 vehicle to visit a Volkswagen dealership. And receive the first software update with the dealership visit will come the installation of a new 12 volt battery and some improvements to performance. That's the same as 2.4 here in uh, in Europe. There are no steps that you need to take at this time. We will be in touch with more detail about the so first software update and when you should co contact your dealer to schedule your visit. Thank you for your patience. We look forward to updating you soon. Warm regards. Um, what software are, will you be getting? Um, I talked to Volkswagen and you will be getting 3.1, but 3.1 in North America is different than 3.1 in Europe. And I asked them what the differences are, but so far I haven't heard back and I wanted to get the news out to you. If I get um, a, a detailed look what the difference is, I will make an extra video. If it's just tiny little things, it would just be a 10 second video, maybe do a short or something. We'll see. But uh, to, at this point, I have not no, don't know what the differences are. They're called the same number, but they have different features for the North American market. So um, if you didn't get that email, you can, you can, uh, um, you know it from me and uh, you, you should get invited by your Volkswagen partner. If not, you should contact your Volkswagen partner. But it's good that finally in North America things are progressing because I heard from uh, a few people that they have problems with software with ID4s in North, in North America and they have uh, it seems like it's bigger problems than the cars in Europe but it could be also that in Europe um, uh, over the air updates to 2.3 or so and now 2.4 in at the dealer um, um, was done and maybe then software works a bit better here in Europe than in North America also published a video today about over the air update 3.0 that Walter should be getting in the next two weeks. Of course, there will be a video on the update as well. So subscribe so you don't miss it. Um, that's it for me. Thank you much for watching. Have a great day and take care. Bye.